channel welcome back to part two of my Primark videos in my previous video I did take you around store and I went to the brand new one at Trafford Centre which is huge it has incredible stock has the new wellness section very white company vibes pretty much stocked up on everything that is in that section um, but I also took you a little bit around the Trafford Centre and took you to the White Company Sale, Selfridges, Muji, Home Sense in that video. So I'll leave it linked below if you did go want to check out part one first. And then today is part two of which I'm sat down showing you everything that I picked up. I got a lot. So sit back, relax, get yourselves ready with a nice cosy drink and some snacks like the candles. And let's begin. So I did get two of the big brown bags, but I also picked up this canvas tote bag, which has some homeware bits in it. So I'll show you this first. I love the idea of this canvas tote. It was on checkout and it was priced at three pounds. And no shade on Primark, because obviously I love Primark, but I like the fact that it's not got any Primark branding on it. It's just plain canvas. Do you know what I mean? The first thing that I picked up is this, which I was in desperate need of a new one. So I've started going out and about doing more runs, just little 3Ks here and there, maybe two or three a week. But whilst on that run, I like to have like a little waste pack like this um, to keep my phone in, my keys, and um, I listen to an audiobook as well whilst I'm out. So I had a really old, ruined pink which we all know pink isn't exactly my preferred colour of choice. I think it was from Poundland years ago. Anyway, it needed replacing and I found this one at £3.50. Okay, I also picked up a brand new reed diffuser. I've spotted this in the wellness section, that gorgeous, neutral, earthy, homeware area. And this is in the scent Retreat, which is blush jasmine, contains essential oils for 100 mils, which lasts up to eight weeks. It is, well, I mean, it says $5.50 on it. So is that about £4.50? I also spotted these, which you'll have seen in that vlog, actually. I showed them. They're the, again, in Retreat. They smell lovely. Blush jasmine, room sachet, 100% linen. So you pop one of these in a room or wardrobe at two pounds. I was tempted to get quite a few of these, but I thought I'm just gonna test it by putting it in my wardrobe. It's got a little hanging thing there as well. And if I notice the difference, then maybe I'll pick up more of these. But for now, I just stuck with the one at two pounds. I used to get back in the day, probably years ago now, acrylic nails and Ever since I moved out of city centre, Manchester city centre, I stopped getting my nails done and I found they got in much better condition. Um, and then I started having gel nails, which is nice, but they still, it does ruin my nails. They're quite weak, my nails, if I have nail polish on them all the time. So I thought I would try out these little nails that they do at a pound a pack. I picked up three different designs and this could be more of like just a temporary, you know, a night out, dinner out, filming a video, that kind of thing. So I'll try these out and let you know how I, you know, get on with them. But I got these matte ones in pecan. And then I got this square letter. I have never heard that word before in my life. I guess it's in between a stiletto and a square nail. Um, so this is in a matte finish. I love this kind of nudey brown color in antique stone. And then another square letto in a glossy finish in the color stone. Again, something else which I showed in that vlog were these two pack of garment bags. These were two pound for a pack of two. And I loved how they were just simple and white. So if you saw my Poundland haul where I showed that they do these beige black and white ones, which are really nice, I actually prefer the just all white, simple, it's really nice fabric. I like the idea of having all matching, especially as we have open wardrobes as well so you can see everything. So yeah, two pound. Is this the last homeware item I got? Well, this is the last thing in this canvas bag anyway. And it is part of, again, that wellness range. It is the Linen and Cotton Border Super King Duvet Set made from sustainable materials. Now, they did have an all linen one in this colour, which was beautiful. And I was very tempted. I was torn between that one and this one. 
but ultimately whenever I have white bedding on it's my fave and these are so affordable super king size bear in mind that's the biggest they do 30 pound okay moving on to clothing now i first things first picked up some basics these i love they're like the seamless three pack thong for five pound i get them in a small which is a 10 to 12. okay sticking with this amazing wellness section honestly this is the first set that i picked up from that range which is the softest fabric i have ever felt I don't know how they do it at such affordable prices. They come in these little cute wooden hangers. The top, I actually sized up to a large in, which is a 14 to 16. So that's the little branding on the inside. And the top was 10 pounds. It's organic cotton. And then the bottoms are like a little cuffed lounge slouchy jogger fit. Nice and high-waisted with the uh, tie waist detail as well and the bottoms are also 10 pounds so in the gray mall in a small for this one the 10 to 12 so 20 pound for this set it's definitely steeper than your average price point for primark but really you're paying for the quality and the sustainability element to it as well because most of the products from this range if not all but don't quote me on that are sustainably sourced. I'm gonna have a nice clear out of my pajamas and loungewear now so that I've got all really good quality ones. The other set that I picked up from that wellness range is this. This is what I mean, white company vibes, luxury element to it, especially with pajamas. These you are paying for, you know, a little bit more, but for great quality. So this, if I show you a little closer up so you can see the texture, it has a kind of uh, stripe design with little wooden buttons. I got this in a medium, so a 12 to 14. So yeah, it is definitely, I've sized up in this. So the top obviously will fit because like I said previously, the bigger the better, the slouchier the fit, the comfortable more comfortable it is and the bottoms they are a tie waist so again hoping that i can just uh cinch them in so that they fit but you know i'm only going to wear these around the house and they don't look too big actually they have pockets they have a really nice hem along the bottom the price for this set was 14 pounds okay the last set that i picked up from the wellness range was actually some active wear and these I'm probably my fave. These are little cycling shorts, which I got in this gray color. These are in a small, a 10 to 12, and these are priced at eight pounds. They're nice and high waisted. They've got these little light seams along the front. Can you see there? So I probably wouldn't wear these to actually work out in these are more lounge active wear, especially working from home. If I stay in pajamas, I'll have a lazy day. If I get dressed, and in particular, if I wear comfy active wear, I feel like I get a lot done and I'm more productive. And then the other parts of that set, that same gray on the side, but then the rest of it is this white and gray kind of pattern. So this is the top. It's definitely more than just a sports bra because it does come a lot lower, but it does have the cups and the support on the inside. This I got in a size 10 to 12 and it is priced at six pounds. And then the bottoms to go with it are these long line leggings, which I got in a medium because they didn't have any smalls. And unfortunately I'm gonna have to take these back because they are too big around the waist. I, I thought they might be to be fair. They've got a little zip at the back. They're really handy to um, keep your like key in or whatever if you're out and about on a run. These are priced at £10. So for this set, the top and the bottom, 16 I'm definitely going to keep this top though and these shorts. They're still, you know, a nice matching set. But I am going to have to take those leggings back. Try and get a small, but if not, I've still got the shorts. The last bag is pretty much full of summery dresses and tops which I wanted to share with you. They had such a good selection at the um, Trafford Centre Primark of summery dresses. Honestly, it was amazing. So I'm sure if you guys aren't new here, you'll know the white kind of linen-y style dress that I have from Primark that I've got so much wear out of. That is still in stores at 15 pounds. And they also have it in a green color which I showed in that vlog as well. And this was another one that they had in both the white and the green. And it's that same material, that kind of linen-y fabric, really nice cottony linen-y, lightweight, but quite 
I don't know, really, really well made, not sheer at all. And it is like a little button down shirt. I sized up in this one. They had all the sizes available, but I wanted to size up. So I got a 14, I sort of held it up to me in store and I was happy with this. I wanted that oversized fit. This would be really nice paired with some little denim shorts on a really hot day jeans we all know and love the primark straight jeans 13 pounds this top was and i cannot get over the quality and the material of that absolutely love it another top that i got was this little brodery style if i compare it to the white you'll be able to see there how this is definitely a more beigey kind of cream color in a size 10 it's 13 pounds a little puff sleeve detail just quite subtle and then it cinches in here around your arm and it also cinches in around the waist. A cute little top, that one. I think it's really, really pretty. This top is gonna be one of those everyday, get so much wear out of it type tops. It's that sheared kind of fabric which gathers, so it's super stretchy and forgiving. You could take the straps down, so if you're sort of sat out in the garden, and it's quite sunny, you don't wanna get strap marks, you can just pop them down and tuck them in. Nice with high-waisted denim shorts or jeans again. And this one was the bargain price of just five pounds. I picked it up in a medium. I don't think they had any smalls available, but because of that gathered material, it's quite versatile for sizing. Next up, I have a swimwear item, which I was thinking of doubling as a bodysuit. I love the colour of this. Again, that rich, creamy kind of colour. It's ribbed, so it's a really nice design, not just like a box standard white swimsuit. It's really well made. And this is made using recycled materials. I got it in a size 8. They didn't have a 10 available, and it was £6. Now, I have tried this on since getting home, and I do feel like it's probably a little bit snug for me, so I might try and see if they have this swimsuit in, in. and if they do, I will switch it out for a 10. Okay, next up is a white linen-y summer's dress. What's new? This is in a UK 10. It's £13. It's got this button-down detail with tortoiseshell buttons, and it's a really nice midi length. So on those days where you're just wanting a longer line dress, this is perfect. It's quite nice and lightweight as well, so it's still for these warmer months. Even for every day around the house, you want to look kind of more presentable. A dress like this is so comfy. Okay, I know I sound like a broken record, but here we have a linen-y, light cream summer's dress. <laughs> Ta-da! I just couldn't get over the selection that they had at Traffic Center, it was so good. So uh, I did size up to a 12 in this one. I don't think they had a 10 available. It's 18 pounds, so a little more pricey for this one in comparison to the rest. But I feel like there's a reason for it. The color, the way that it's made, it's like a really nice ivory cream color. It's got the puffy sleeve detail. It's a very boho chic, kind of free people vibes. And it's quite thick. So again, it's so well made that you've got no worries with it being sheer or anything like that. Nude underwear, you're absolutely fine. And it is matte as well with a little frill hem at the bottom so really nice floaty airy fairy boho chic dress that you can just picture i don't know having a picnic in the fields that kind of thing something like this from somewhere like free people you'd be looking at the into the hundreds so yeah 18 pounds really is well worth it okay and last but not least we're ending on a white summer's dress this again is a maxi dress is it maxi or mid axi i'm going to say maxi i got it in a 10 they had different colors available in this one as well actually it was 15 pounds nice and thick this is definitely a white and it's got this ruffle kind of detail running below the bust but also um kind of below the bum and also by your shins now the only sort of downside or negative I have to this dress, which I have no idea why they've done this, they've double lined this top part here. So when you have it on, they'd have been better off either double lining the entire thing, which would have been good, or not doing it at all and just wearing nude underwear and being fine because you can see when you're wearing it that this part is whiter than the rest of it and i noticed it once trying it on so considering i have quite a few white summer dresses here i might send this one back can you tell i like white <laughs> that's exactly what i meant by 
the wellness section being white company style and these are just you know it's just the style I like, okay? So there we have it, that is everything that I picked up on this shopping trip to Primark. Again, if you wanted to see more styles and what was new in, then be sure to head over and check out my previous video if you haven't already. Thank you so, so much for watching. Do subscribe for more, and I'll leave my Instagram handles down below if you did want to follow me over on my fashion or homeware account, maybe both, who knows? Thanks again for watching, and I hope to see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.